Hello guys, today in this clip I want to talk to you about a very very hot topic. It is plastic surgery. And then I will answer the question, should it be illegal for teenagers to go under plastic surgery? First, I would like to ask you a question. What comes out of your mind when hearing the word plastic surgery? Is that a Hollywood star trying to delay the effects of aging? Or is that a number of actresses and actors going under the knife to become more beautiful? What about v light chin, red side breast, and hard nose? Or is that career a kingdom of plastic surgery? All that those images are right. However, plastic surgery does mean more than that. Now, let's define what plastic surgery is. Interestingly, you know that the word plastic doesn't mean patients who have the surgery end up with a face full of fake stuff. Indeed, plastic in Greek means to form or to mold, and there are two types of plastic surgery. First, it is reconstructive surgery, and this procedure helps correct defects on face or body, and including physical birth defects such as cleft lips or ear deformities or traumatic injuries from dog bites or burns. The second type is cosmetic surgery and also called aesthetic surgery. This procedure helps alter a part of the body, including enlarging the breast, reshaping the nose, and removing pockets of fat out of the body. And, you know, in fact, not just adults, but the number of teenagers craving for changes for better look is on the rise. So, what causes this rise? Why do teens get plastic surgery? I think there are three reasons. First, teenagers want to become fit in. They want to boost their self-esteem. You know, teenagers with abnormal parts of the body are easy victims of bullying. No one is completely satisfied with their appearance, even I myself. The year I was 12, I used to look at the mirror and for hours on end, complaining and blaming my mother on not handing down her beauty to me. The second reason is the advance in surgical technology. There is help raise the quantity and quality of plastic surgeries. The final reason in my opinion, is that the widespread popularity of social media with numerous images of beautiful models, singers, actors, or actresses also boost the crave of young people to become prettier. Mm. Next, um, the question is raised, is plastic surgery the right choice for teenagers? You know, Reconstructive surgery does help repair significant defects, and it also enhances the confidence of teenagers. For example, there is an organization with a very, very famous program called Operation Smile Vietnam. This program helps repair childhood facial deformities while building public and private partnerships that advocate for sustainable healthcare system for children and families. And their motto is, together we create smiles, change lives, and heal humanity. So, in this view, plastic surgery is really a good choice. Meanwhile, cosmetic surgery is worth careful and more serious consideration. A person's body continues to change through teen years. Body parts that might appear too large or too small now can become more proportionate over time. And that is the reason why plastic surgery should not be applied to body parts that are under change. Also, plastic surgery always comes with risks, including risks during surgery hour and risks after surgery, for example, unwanted misshape and allergies. These days, netizens are sharing a clip about a girl who wants to look exactly like Pink Pink and has spent 8 years on cosmetic surgery. 
put tears out of her mom's heart. Mother sat in tears that. Now, I can't not realize my daughter anymore. She is totally a very different person. Mm, in this video, cosmetic surgery is not at all a right choice. So, I will answer the main question. Should plastic surgery be illegal for anyone under 18? After formal discussion, my answer to this question is absolutely no. And here is my suggestion. Plastic surgery under the form of reconstructive procedures is acceptable, while cosmetic procedures must be implemented after thorough consultation from doctor and agreement from parents. Teenagers, before deciding to go on the knife, should weigh the pros and cons of the coming surgery. Trying to gain beauty is good. However, everything has its price, not only the tremendous financial cost, but also the cost on future mental and physical health as well. There are other ways to become prettier, such as appropriate weight control and exercise. Plastic surgery isn't something to rush into, so teenagers should consider carefully and talk it over with doctors and parents before taking the step. This is the end of my, of my presentation, and thanks for listening. This is my own opinion, so if you have any disagreement, disagreement, please feel free to comment below the post, then we will discuss this problem more thoroughly. By the way, if anyone is watching this clip and there is no my mom, please help me tell her that I'm sorry. I love myself now, and I'm completely satisfied and cherish the beauty mom gives me. Thank you.